What's up you guys, it's True here and today is collecting con day and I'm very excited. I'm gonna go right now, but I just wanted to make a little intro and uh, talk about what I want to find. There's a few stuff that I want. Um, one of them is the Luca uh, rookie card, PSA 10, if I can find it. Uh, a bunch of these Scarlet and Violet, um, not the base uh, set cards, but like just from any of uh, Scarlet and Violet uh, sets. Um, from Obsidian Flames, Paradox Rift, and all the new sets that have came out. Uh, I want just like the um, illustration rares and all the secret rares and um, I also want the Japanese uh, classic collection cards if they have some um, and some Yu-Gi-Oh cards that I'll be showing. Um, just a bunch of stuff that I, I really want and I'll, I'll show some of my stuff that I'm taking so I can trade or sell so I can get those cards and yeah so i'm gonna go right now and we'll see how it goes and i hope i can have fun and find the stuff that i i've been looking for so yeah all right so i'll see you guys there and here is all the things i'm taking that i might uh trade or sell i have a fusion strike booster box i have a chillin rain booster box evolving skies booster box i was debating if i should uh, so this one I traded, but here we are, and then uh, Eevee Heroes, um, and some booster bundles from 151, and I have uh, some of my slabs in here, so, oh, here's my backpack, and here's my backpack, and I have a 151 binder with some singles in there, and I'm not going to take my trades because uh, I don't really have trades, um, I just mostly have these sealed boxes, and I have other stuff I'll show here in a bit. Here's also this Luka Doncic jersey that I got uh, autographed and I'm gonna take it to PSA to see if they can authenticate it and I've never really done this so I'm not sure how it's gonna go so we'll see. Alright guys, we made it to Collecticon. I'm very excited to go inside. I got my stuff ready. I got my cards, my Luka Doncic jersey. I got it in the bag and into my backpack. So I'm very ready and I'll show everything that I get. I'll show me on the way there, everything that I see, or I'll try to get everything or as much as I can. But yeah, I'm ready. I'm gonna actually just start walking right now and I'll see you guys in there. All right. All right, and also right before I go, um, I want to mention that I also made a uh, my first Collecticon video. I'll put the link in somewhere in here uh, if you guys want to watch it. I went last year and it was pretty awesome, so I appreciate if you would watch that video. Um, but also, I uh, want to make like an objective of what I, everything I want to get before I start going. So um, I'll drop images so you can, so you can see or. It depends how long it takes to uh, for me to edit this video, but I'll try to put in images of everything that I want. So uh, the first thing I have on my list is the uh, Luka Doncic uh, PSA 10 rookie card, um, and then the um, also for Pokemon, um, Paldean and Fates. Uh, I want the Charizard illustration rare, the Mew, the shiny Mew, the shiny Charizard, shiny Gardevoir. I already have the Iono Japanese one, um, so I might not get that one in English. I also want the uh, the Japanese classic collection, the, specifically the Charizard, Charizard. It looks pretty cool. And then I want my uh, EV VMAX cards back, the um, uh, alt art because I sold most of them. I kept my Moonbrion, but and then finally I have a I want the uh, Paradox Rift illustration rares, all of the uh, the new cards that are just coming out that are illustration rares because I believe that they are all pretty uh, cheap right now and pretty uh, good priced so yeah that's uh, most of it I also want the Roaring Moon EX illustration rare I want Iron Valiant um, uh, just all these cards oh and I also forgot I've never got the uh, the gold uh, Giratina V-Star Arceus V-Star gold and Pakia V-Star so yeah those are uh, the main cards that I'm looking for so hopefully we can find them and yeah We'll see if we, if we get it. All right, I'll show what's in here. I forgot to show. Uh, so a little bunch of it is a lot of uh, Shining Fates, um, or Shining Legends, I'm sorry, from back in the day. Um, right here, 
type of this charger promo from the chicken span uh celebi from what was it from fusion strike and or jet black, jet black spirit from japanese um and then shiny genesect uh, charizard uh, this um 25th anniversary japanese um psa 10 charizard most of these are PSA 10s. This is Quasa. Okay. The, um, the cooler ones are these two right here. My Poncho Pikachu Japanese that I got back from 2016 when they first came out. I bought the box for $80 and it came with that one and it came with this one as well. And apparently, um, they are worth a lot now. So I got lucky on that. And actually Grady V's at um Collecticon. So yeah. And then I think I show this one. Yeah, I might take all of it, I might not. I think I might just take the uh Pikachu's or the ones that are, that are worth more, like the Pikachu's, the Charizards. And I think that's it. Maybe the uh the quads out but yeah, I just need some something to sell or trade to get other stuff that I that I want. That's my side. It was like uh, oh, you have someone, move someone brought one to me earlier. I marketed at or I comp average at 490 market. 490. But if I'm buying in cash, I don't pay full market, obviously. Yeah. So I paid them like. <laughs> paid them 350. 350. Cash. Okay. And then if you do this, 400. Twenty. Okay. I'll just cash for all this. If you do a uh, trade, it gets a little bit better. Yeah. But if you want, you wanted all of them or just? Yeah. Well. Yeah, I guess all three. You wanted all three? Yeah. Two eighty. Two ninety. Three fifty. Oh yeah, they can help you. Right there. Trading okay. Yeah, pretty good. Probably someone else's. Yeah, there's like another one over there. Like just sitting. Like we walked by. I'm everywhere. Like, I know y'all probably paid like ten dollars for this water <laughs> bottle and y'all just left it. Yeah, I brought my own Texas spray, yeah. so I'm not paying those. <laughs> I'm just double checking. Yeah, sure. Take your time. Yeah, I can help you out. Okay, okay. While he's figuring That's it out. That's the one he's looking at. Okay. Finder. Okay. There's anything Okay. okay. Trade, that's easier. Yeah. Well, he made me buy it with cash. Yeah, cash is easier. 
Okay. Yeah, trade, like, it has to go through. Yeah. yeah. Actually don't. Sorry. That, I'm sure someone does. Though. They're they're out there. <laughs> we found we found we tried to find one. We found the red budget. Oh really? Are you trying to look for a graded one or? The, 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 the one that's like twenty dollars. Sure. I'm sure someone will have one. <laughs> um. Yeah. It's like, I'll pass on that. All right. Um, I will. I'll I'll keep thinking about it. I'll I'll come back. Twenty on top. Uh, what are you thinking? Then? Is that how much is that again? Three fifty? One thirty-five, one sixty-five, one fifty-five. Four, four fifty-five. Four fifty, my bad. Yeah, four fifty. Four fifty-five. I said four cash on this. So let's say. So four ninety is market for that. That <laughs> ten on top? You want to do it just, just for that? Straight. Uh, I'll double check. It shouldn't be too much. You don't, you don't sell any fanny packs? Packs? Uh, fanny, fanny no, packs? No, no, no. Can I actually keep the plastic one? Uh, yes. I don't want to keep it. Well, that's fine. You can do, keep it. Do you want a little...
Riley, nobody would have the future. Yeah, let's go somewhere else to open the door. Yeah. Someone literally cleaned us 
month we've got this one left to vend them, but ever, otherwise never cleared us out today. Someone came and literally bought a stack of like 40. Yeah, the Wemby's I have left aren't, they aren't graded. Yeah. I have a few left that are uh, raws. Yeah, know, like the minor. raw Donruss and Hot, Gooch yeah. rookies, nothing special. Oh, yeah. Someone came the in new Monopoly, like, the new Monopoly rookie, we got those. Yeah. Sorry, I don't have cash. <laughs> Gotcha. Yeah. yeah. Wipe, wipe this we'll be here tomorrow too. Yeah. Okay. I, I might come tomorrow. Yeah. Absolutely, man. That's the only one you have. Set up? Yes. That's the only up? one of these I have. Okay. Where are you guys set up? Hopefully, I have this spot right here. Thank you, anyways. Yeah. 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 All right, so I just left the uh, convention. I did a lot of trades. It was pr so much fun. Uh, there was a lot of people. The place was kind of packed. Uh, last year, it was packed too, but I don't remember it being that bad as today. I mean, it still wasn't that bad, but um, I got a lot of trades. I got, got a lot of cards that I wanted. Got rid of my Evolving Skies booster box, um, my um, Chillin' Rain booster box, and my Fusion Strike booster box. And what else did I get rid of? I think that was it. And I got a lot of singles in trade for those. So I'll be showing some some of those trades. Now I got some pizza. And I'm gonna be eating. Also got this Gyarados. It's pretty cool. Um Yeah, um walk into my car right now and I'll show everything I got. All right, let's have a mukbang. Just kidding. Um, got some pizza here. Uh, looks pretty good. Uh, I guess I'll just talk about some stuff that I got. Oh, it's good. So I got some of the V Maxes uh, e EV Heroes. I got a bunch of singles that uh, from Paradox Rift or um, just the newest sets. I can't remember their names. I was about to get a Luca Silver rookie card. But they only, they only accepted cash and I didn't have cash. I got this Gyarados. It's pretty cool. I got some little figures that I'll show here in a bit. Uh, but most of uh, the most of the expensive stuff that I got were the EV Heroes or the EV V Max cards. All right, so I graded my <clears throat> Poncho Pikachu Rayquaza. Uh, regular and the shiny. I graded it last year at uh, Collecticon, and I paid around three hundred dollars or two hundred dollars, something like that. I got PSA nines on both. Mm, I can see why they got PSA nines. The centering was off, but um, uh, to this time I didn't. I didn't submit any for grading. I didn't. I don't really like grading cards unless they're like going for a lot, and those are my, those are my, my most expensive cards. Uh, I think I would only grade if they're worth like a thousand dollars raw and even then I probably I still think about it the only reason why I even did it for the Pancho Pikachu is because I don't know just I like having them on slabs for those because I don't I'm not gonna have them in binders uh, they don't go with anything else like the other ones I'll, I'll keep them in binders because they're like in sets like the new cards so I can put them in like the same binder or whatever but yeah so that was it for Collecticon. Um, I was expecting it a little better. I was a little too packed. Um, 
a lot going on obviously i liked it better at the other convention center i forgot what it was called but it was in fort worth today it was at uh in dallas i think it, i think the convention center is called kate hutchinson or something like that i didn't like it as much but it's whatever i still had fun all right so these are the cards that i got um at collecticon got the mela illustration rare parasol lady full art got the uh, sandy shocks ex illustration rare professor turo's uh, scenario illustration rare um Shinpao ex and iron iron valiant ex illustration rare i got all of these for uh two booster boxes that i traded um <clears throat> and then i got these little figures um this uh shiny gyarados i think it was like six dollars this Snorlax, um, these are 3D uh, printed uh, for uh, I think like $10 or so. This Ampharos, my favorite one, for $12. Very nice, very shiny. I love this one a lot. And another Gyarados. This is, um, I don't know what color this is, but it looks kind of like steel. I don't know. And then they gave me this one for free. They were uh, very nice. And then I got this um, plushy uh, shiny Gyarados. Very cool. Um, I was mad because I bought it for 35 and then I saw it somewhere else for 20 But it's all good. And then the um, one of my favorite ones. my favorite, One of my favorite trades for today. So I got the v maxes for a evolving skies booster box that i traded and three booster bundles of uh, 151 so yeah let me take them out really quick okay so this sylveon came with all of these for the two booster boxes it was a uh, chilling rain booster box and fusion strike uh, booster box and then i think that was a pretty good trade and then i got these three um for i traded a evolving skies booster box and three 151 booster bundles for these three um i might have been ripped off a little bit but it's okay because i i got the evolving skies booster box for like 120 so in reality i i actually won i guess i could have gotten more out of that trade but i just wanted to get get it out of the way and uh, he also had these three which were the ones that i needed and this Sylveon, I got it later on. So it was like, a, it was a fast trade and it was something I wanted to get out, get out the way. So yeah, so far this is everything I got. And then the final ones. So I submitted this to PSA at last year's Collecticon. And I got a PSA, <clears throat> sorry. I got PSA 9 on both. Um, but yeah, they look pretty cool. <clears throat> They go for around a thousand thousand dollars, I believe, or a thousand three hundred at most. But yeah, these are very beautiful. They're my my holy grail for my collection. And I was about to sell them today, but I decided not to. I'm gonna hold them for longer and yeah. And I think that's it. That's all I got for Collecticon. I couldn't really find much. Oh, uh, mostly I just mostly saw a lot a bunch of um, slabs that I didn't I don't really like slabs um, and then I also saw a bunch of like Charizards and I didn't really see many like full arts cheap full arts I, I was looking for a lot of cheap full arts of the newer sets like uh, Paradox Rift and whatnot and I was looking for Japanese cards like, there was not many Japanese cards I was even lucky to find these EVs. Oh, I guess almost everyone had the EVs, but I don't know. I just didn't see m much like things that I wanted. Like I barely even found these Paradox Rift cards. Like not many people had them. Um, so I don't know. I was look. I was looking like all over the place. I I went around like three times. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Um, leave a like and uh, subscribe if you want. But yeah, alright guys, see you on the next one. And stay safe. Bye.